Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, my name is Paige aka The Other Simmer and welcome to my first CC Showcase video. This video is going to be looking at five different CC sets. These could just be fully decor sets or they could have some functional items in it for your sims as well. These items will add a touch of realism to your game, whether that just be regular gameplay or maybe you're trying to tell a story. So the first set that we're going to be looking at here is the fridge decor set by Picard Sims. So this set comes with two magnets, a whiteboard, some notes, postcards, a towel, receipts, and calendar, and each item has their own amount of swatches as well. So we're going to be looking at those swatches for these individual items, but when you download this set, it does also come with a wall decor item, which is kind of categorized as a floor decor item, but this allows you to attach it to some uh, refrigerators that you have in your game so this has its own set of swatches as well so we'll take a look at the individual items first these sticky notes as you can see they are down here in the build by category and they are only set as separate swatches like each icon is a swatch so you're not going to be able to click on this and change the swatches for them but starting with the calendar here these are the amount of swatches that this item comes with so we're going to cycle through them you can see that you'll have a plain swatch with just the numbers and then a secondary swatch where the numbers are crossed out as if your sim is trying to track an event or just cross out the days that may have already passed and if you can see in simlish like this one will say october november then January, February, March, April, May, all of the months. <laughs> and over here we have two magnets. We have a heart magnet and we have a teddy bear magnet and they also come with their own set of swatches. Pretty much all the colors of the rainbow for this heart one and then for the teddy bear one, it turns into different animals. So you have a frog, pig, koala, some teddy bears. And that is just the cutest amount of swatches ever. Then over here we do have the whiteboard and this whiteboard comes with 36 swatches so each swatch will be different they will showcase different things even the markers change colors as well so you do have the different swatches for the picture itself and then they come with different colored frames then over here we have some set of receipts with its own little magnet on top of it as well. This one comes with 15 swatches and the magnet color changes along with its pattern and so do the receipt colors. And then up here we have postcards and these postcards are utilizing the teddy bear magnet and the heart magnet and the picture itself will change colors. So you have a couple sims here, some scenery, then over here we have a towel on a hook. So looking at this towel here, the towel itself has 60 swatches. So lots of different color variants. Each color has its own set of patterns as well. So lots of possibilities here in terms of what kind of color theme you're going for your kitchen. And then onto the separated package itself that are items that are supposed to attach directly to the fridge so you're using the whiteboard the postcards and the sticky notes here as a complete set and these items these individual items they all go on to cork boards and we will check those out as well. So each of these individual items do snap on to any cork boards that you're using, whether that be base game cork boards, kit cork boards, or CC cork boards that you might have in your game. And like I mentioned earlier, this separate piece here that comes with the set can for the most part fit properly on different fridges that you might be using in your game so this is a base game fridge here then we have a cottage living fridge here a snowy escape fridge over here and a cc fridge that i have in my game 
And then the next CC set we have is also by Picard Sims, and this is their Moving In set. So you have various different boxes here, both closed and opened. And then you also have a little bag here that's supposed to mimic an Ikea bag. And each of these boxes do have their own swatches as well as slots. The open boxes have slots, and these boxes can also stack upon one another like that so they all come in different colors and they also have maybe some shipping labels on the side as well you have six different color swatches and each color swatch has its own variant with the maybe some writing on it or even some shipping labels on them as well and then for the bag we have two different swatches so we have a very bright orangey swatch here and a blue swatch and then we're going to just go ahead and take some decor items and see what we can fit inside of the boxes itself so by using the same cc bottle that i had here i went ahead and filled in all of what i believe to be the decor slots for each of the open boxes as well as the bag that we have here so just so you can get a general idea of how many slots there are in each open box as well as the bag in case you want to add a little bit more realism to the set as well Next up, we have the Retro Remix set by Leaf Motif. And in the set, you will get a bunch of tiny little decor items for your kitchen. And what I absolutely loved about this set is it has a sink here <laughs> that has some dishes inside of it. So we're gonna be taking a look at the swatches and then we will check out the functionality. So here's the different swatches for the sink piece. And then moving on to the counter aspects, we have several different swatches for these. I love this green swatch. And then we do have some mix and match here for the lid and the pot piece itself. This is a really nice one. For this one, the same color variants. So you can mix and match with these sets or you can just Keep them all one color so you do have a standard white swatch and a standard black swatch as well this set also comes with a tiny little egg here that cannot be <laughs> that cannot change the color of it it does not have uh, separate swatches for it neither does the loose little orange here but the bowl of oranges does and so does the egg carton And then we have some tiny little sugar cubes here, a little sugar bowl. You can resize these items in case you don't want them to be super big. So if you wanted to stack these bowls elsewhere or make these oranges smaller, maybe you want large eggs, <laughs> whatever have you. And as you can see, the sink is still very functional even with the dishes inside. So next on our list is the Traveler set by Sibulet. Sibulet is actually one of my favorite CC creators because they add just so many details to their CC sets and you can just put together so many variants and just different ways to decorate your Sims house. So this is a set just recently released, I believe on June 23rd. So be sure to grab that set. So this set actually comes with the decor items, the decor luggages but they also have functional luggages as well. So you have the decor kid backpack here, but you have a functional one as well. So this duffel bag is also functional, but a decor set and the suitcase as well. You also have a functional digital camera over here as well, which I thought was a really nice touch. So we're gonna look at the different color swatches for this set. So first starting off with the beauty case, these are the color swatches for the beauty case you do have some prints at the end here which are really nice then we'll take a look at the pile of shirts here and which are really nice because you can also just add these to maybe any kind of uh, closet setups that you might have for your sims we do also have some vacation photos here which was a really really nice touch because maybe you're going to the beach or going to a really nice city, maybe you're heading to the mountains, the fields, or even a really snowy area. 
Then we have a passport and travel guide, which I thought was a really nice touch. This item does not have any different color swatches, but we have a straw summer hat that does. And it's just plain colors here for the summer hat. And then we have some sandals that come in a wide range of colors. You can go from plain colors to some very colorful ones. And these, I think they match the same color swatches as the actual sandals that your Sims can wear from Create a Sim. And for the functional camera, it does also have different color swatches as well, which are very nice colors. They're kind of like a pastel or muted, so they're not very loud, but I like them. They're, they're actually really soft colors. For the duffel bag here, we do have different color variants, which are very nice. The thing about Sibila at CC is that you kind of get a mix and match of Alpha and Maxis match with their textures, which I personally like because then it actually kind of looks realistic without looking too out of place, if that makes sense. <laughs> for the kids backpack, it's still going to be an owl as the animal for it, but you do have variant different color swatches here. For the picture on the wall, this is actually a really nice touch. So in case your sim travels to specific areas, you can add some pictures in here. So looking at the different color swatches here, this changes the wood color for the picture frame and for the wood that is bordering the map itself. And for the suitcase, we have different color variants as well. Some solid colors as well as some really nice patterns. And for the open suitcase, it also follows the same color swatches down here as well. So I had my sim actually use the functional camera to take some photos of the item set. And when I tell you like the quality on these photos, this camera is absolutely <laughs> amazing. Like, you know how you'll take regular photos in game using like your sim's phone or whatever. So you can't take selfie pictures with this obviously, but having a really good camera to take high quality photos like this, like look how that looks far away. That's amazing. And you just slot them into the photo frames here, so it is a very, very nice touch. And I do actually have my sim picking up the suitcase, as you can see on the left side there. The same thing works with the duffel bag that we had. And for this open suitcase here, you can actually utilize it. And the last set that we have here is also by Sabrulette, and this is called the Playa Set. And these are beach themed items this is a functional kiddie pool you have a decor version and a functional version as well as the beach towel which comes in a decor version and a functional version and then this sandcastle actually functions as a dollhouse and then we do have some little swim safe armbands here you will have a version in create a sim exclusively for toddlers so let's look at the swatches here for the beach towel you got some limes and lemons some mingos if some of these items look familiar you might have seen them in my miko's journal series as well as my back series where i just use only some of the options for decor to make it feel a little bit more realistic when my family went to the beach and i used this bag in beck's apartment so we're going to take a look at the magazine sunglasses and sunscreen swatches here so this only changes the color of the sunglasses the flip-flops also come with their own really cool swatches as well. I think they actually match, they kind of match the beach ball a little bit. And then we do have some seashells here, which do not have any swatches. And then these armbands here, you should get the same color swatches and create a sim for your toddlers. And then we have some scuba diving gear, which also follows the same sort of swatches that you might see for the flip-flops, sunglasses, and beach ball. And for the kiddie pool, the same type of patterns that follow the beach towel and the armbands here and then we have a really nice umbrella okay. 
So that is it for my CC showcase. You can actually find the links for each of these CC sets in the description below. But if you follow me on my CC finds blog on my Tumblr page, you will also find these listed there as well. Hopefully you like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.